Hey there everyone, welcome back to my channel. And the next movie review I have for you guys is called In the Heights. And this movie was released on June 9th, 2021. It is a musical drama film. Uh, cinema score has an average grade of an A. It has an 8 out of 10 on IMDb, a 97% on Rotten Tomatoes, and an 85% on Google. Well, the movie was directed by John M. Chu and written by Kiara Allegra Hughes. And it stars Anthony Ramos, Corey Hawkins, Leslie Grace, Melissa Barima, Barrera, excuse me, and Lynn Morel Miranda. In this movie, a young man uh, dreams of uh, making a big, uh, and you have... Uh, a neighborhood that is uh, a close-knit type of family who all dream of uh, making it big as well and uh, doing their own thing and getting out of the neighborhood and uh, you know, moving on to bigger and better things. But at the end of the day, they realize what they have is so precious and that they really want to stay. And then in the midst of it all, uh, you have a lot of great music. And it starts off with a bang. Man, you're, you're hit right away with the song. And uh, I, I must say, this is this is one of the better musicals I've seen probably since La La Land. And uh, yeah, this is, this is an amazing movie. Uh, very heartwarming. It is a tearjerker. I, I knew at some point something was going to happen. I won't spoil what it is. But yeah, it, it, oh... Man, just a up and down type of movie, but the music is where it's at. Half the movie they're singing. Well, about half the movie they're singing. They're about about sixty minutes worth of songs. The movie's two hours and fifteen minutes, I believe. Uh, but it flies by, especially if you just sing along with the songs. Uh, it just it flies by really quick. I love the characters. Uh, the songs don't get me started. I love the songs. Lin Manuel Miranda did a great job with this movie, and uh, I watched him the other night on the Tonight Show with Jimmy Fallon, and he just seems like a cool man and someone to be nice to work with and uh, just have a lot of fun uh, doing these movies and. Uh, doing Broadway. I can't imagine what it would be like to do Broadway with him. But yeah, amazing film. I highly recommend you check it out if you haven't seen it. Uh, if musicals aren't your thing, then I'd say skip it. Uh, but if they are your thing, check it out. You won't be disappointed. It's an amazing film. So in the comment section below, if you've seen it, give me your thoughts and opinions. For me, I'm giving In the Heights a 10 out of 10 and two thumbs up. And, uh, yeah, let me know what you thought. Did you like it, love it, hate it, think it's overrated? Let me know. And if you're new to the channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit that notification bell. And if you like this review, hit that like button. But other than that, stay tuned for my next top. 20 list and I'm going to give you guys my top 20 uh, Samuel L. Jackson movies of the 1990s so stay tuned for that video as well I thank you guys for watching and check you later